You said no spiders. There's no chance. Yeah. guys will here welcome to the video so you guys know my birthday is on august 30th i'm turning 27 years old yes i know i look like i'm 17. my face does not match my body but regardless i'm getting older i only live once so i want to face my fears so my girlfriend katie and my older sister victoria and my good friend max who is not here planned a whole day for me to face my fears i have no idea what's going to happen they are going to lead the way today and they're going to be the host of the day so what's like what's well i have my little bag of tricks here yeah. which I will be bringing back yeah. throughout the day, um, but I thought you might need this. I did say before we before we start. Yeah. Um, I said I would pretty much do anything except for two things: two spiders things. Uh -huh. and and cake donuts. Right? No cake donuts. No cake donuts. Cake donuts. Oh. Spiders and cake donuts. <laughs> One of the two is in there. I don't know. We'll have to find out. Okay. Take this. It's a little stressful for you. Yeah. Um, and I thought we might as well just start this off. This is. Oh, I, like that. I feel like more unpleasant than <clears throat> scary, but we yeah. just thought it was funny. I was looking around. These are the worst rated chips on Amazon. Um, okay. Don't don't look at the flavor. Yeah. Just just eat one. Don't look at the flavor. Don't look at the flavor. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Did I get? Okay, this is how this day is gonna go. <laughs> yeah. Oh God. I feel like this is foreshadowing to something. Snake. Yeah, snake. Oh, that's like what we're doing? Yeah, actually. I just said that, actually. actually. Oh. So today we have brought Josh here, and he's like Canada's Bear Grylls, more or less. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, so today he has a couple snakes for you to hold. Okay. Um, so we'll start with the first nicer snake. And I did hear snakes are like, aren't they like the thing that most people are afraid of in the world? Like it's like the number one fear in the world, you were saying? Uh, well, it's, it's a common fear for animals. Yeah. But the number one fear in the world is is uh, fear of public speaking. So what, what, what kind of snake are we? Well, well just, why don't you just find out? Here's Open a bag. It. I'm just going There's in. There's a snake in there. You figure it out. Ooh. It's probably not venomous. Ooh. Crikey. Oh my God. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh my God. <laughs> well, Do they bite? Everything can bite. And certainly these, these can bite. We'll see how it goes. Caution, biting. This is a type of snake called a pine snake. Got some core strength. He's really like holding it up. Oh yeah. Hello. <laughs> this is a North American snake, one of the biggest snakes you can get in North America. Really? And oh. this is a female. Oh. Can I touch her? Oh yeah, mama. There Hello, dude. What's up? Hi. You know, we talk, we talk about them being venomous because of the uh, the fangs this is that they this have. Is, this is venomous. No. Oh, okay. With this species of snake, it's actually the uh, the skin secretions that are dangerous. He's got nostrils like me. Yeah, he does. Just like, look at them. We look. We have some similarities. Yeah. Yeah. So this is like kind of like the this is like the starter pack kind of thing. This yeah. is a starter snake. Yeah. Starter snake. Well, let's we'll see that? what happens with this one. Yeah. Well, this one just came in matching don't, matching don't your, pillowcases don't for you. Don't get your faces close for this one, Will. And then this one. This is, one is the largest snake species in Canada. Okay. And uh, these snakes are also. Known yeah, for making ahead. loud noise. Don't put my head in. Your You're being serious. No, we don't put yeah, my head in. Yeah, yeah, like watch okay. your face. Put I don't know what's true or what's not right you now. You can yeah. go ahead. I don't know what's going to happen, but go ahead. <laughs> See what happens. <sighs> Come on, you do one. <laughs> Have these things been fed recently? No. No, okay. <laughs> face your fear as well. Uh, oh my god. Oh, yeah, I don't Come know. With your face. Well, this one's way too mobile for me. Yeah, little... it. There we are. Woo! Hey. And again, this is a small one. They get to be over twice that size and Support about her. as thick yeah. as your arms. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Hey. You're good. You're hey. good. Deep breath. She likes you. It's a male. <laughs> oh, he's hissing. Yep. <clears throat> and so this snake has the closest things to uh, a windpipe of any snake. So they are very loud when they hiss and get agitated. And of course, that's a warning that they're about to potentially take the next step, so. Okay, so he's pissed. Should I put him down? No. Oh! oh. Pick it up. There you go. I have like a similar feeling when you like text me we need to talk. <laughs> I, I have like, like that body, like that, that body shake. <laughs> oh. Does it feel any different, same thing? <sighs> this one feels, feels just... more tense. Yeah. Yeah. I'm definitely so more tense you. too, yeah. yeah, which adds to it. 
You're doing well so far. What would though. you rate this fear experience out of 10? Ah. Oh, oh shit. Sorry. It's about to be a nine. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a, I'm going to give this a eight. Put, t put taking it out of there was like a 10. It's goosebumps, man, on hair. I feel like I was, it, it hits me now once the snakes are off me. From blue and red. I, I don't know. Apparently. Like, yeah, so, today could not so be good for my heart. Okay, so Will, um, for our next challenge, um, it will be an eating challenge. Okay, I'm good at those. Yes, you are, um, yeah. but this one comes with a twist. So we're going to ask you to lay down, take your shirt off, and put this on. Take my shirt off? Take your shirt take off. Your shirt off. I'm eating blindfolded. Quick tip for you all out there, even the smelliest of fish does not bite back. Are you really excited? I mean, I kind of am because I don't know what to expect, right? Okay. Okay. It's kind of so... like the snake thing. It's like kind of undoing a zipper you don't know what you're going to get. Something's gonna be put onto you. It's not an animal, is it? No. Well, kind of. I don't know what this is classified as. What? How does it feel? How does it feel? It just feels moist. Does it? Good. Yeah. Do you like that word? Do you like being moist? Do you guys call the cops out what you're scaring me with? It's a fire truck. I didn't hide my stash. What is this? <laughs> what do you think it oh. is? Oh. Stop moving. What the actual... <laughs> oh my god, hey. Okay, well, you can take your blindfold off, but just don't freak out. Okay? No. Yeah, take it off. <laughs> no! <laughs> Why do I feel like there's fucking slugs on me? You have bleaches on you. Oh. It's okay. You're good, you're good. You're Breathe. Good. <laughs> Breathe. Can you pull one by my nipple? She's yeah. got oh, it. She, we're sucking right She's latched on? Is she yeah. latched on? Yeah. You think some milk? Yeah, I think that's good. I feel like there's one like, underneath me. I hope it doesn't crawl into my butt. You wish. It's definitely more uncomfortable feeling. The, the snakes was more of like the unknown. Oh, this one's actually like sucking your neck. Yeah, I know, it's nice. That's what's rescuing me right now. Okay. This must be some sort of like Japanese foreplay. <laughs> yeah, right. Is it working? Yeah, okay, so of. Katie, bring bring on the, the Timbits. They're not just any Timbits though. So, the challenge of this is in order to get the leech is off. We have stuffed these with different insects. Okay? Victoria's gonna give you the list you of the no, insects. No, you didn't. Of course you did. Victoria's gonna give you. There the are six insects. possible insects here. So the options are grasshopper, cricket, dung beetle, moth, mealworm, or earwig. No, no. Yeah. So, no. One bite. One bite the moth. The whole thing? The whole thing. Mm. What is that? <laughs> Crunchy? It's a mind over matter thing. I'm gonna have to say mealworm because it's a very soft experience still. I, was, was, I wasn't getting much crunch. That was, that was correct! Was. Yay! Ugh. You know your insects! Oh! oh. What are you tasting right now? There's like a yeah. leg in my teeth. Yeah. Oh fuck. I'm gonna go moth. It was very, it was very, it was, it, it was like, it was like chip-like. I think I got a wing. Um, no, you are incorrect, and I will tell you what it is after. More chips, but not least. These things are acting up too. Oh. <laughs> Chew it. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> That's a hundo P, a damn beetle, or... Is that the worst of the bunch? That's the first time I've ever actually swallowed a tidbit whole, so you know that. <coughs> that. I'm going with a dung beetle. Okay, well, so you got one of three. The first one was mealworm. The second one was a cricket. And you just ate a grasshopper. A oh my grasshopper. god, that was, a, that was a fat daddy. So we actually decided, Will, that because you only got one of three right, you have to eat a leech. For real? No. Yeah. Okay. <laughs>
So we are on our way to our third stop. I have to be blindfolded apparently. This is supposed to be a day of fears, but you guys have me in my comfort zone. <laughs> um, so I have no idea where we're going. Um, that's the whole point. That's, I guess that is the whole point. I mean, when you're blindfolded, everything just feels so much longer and bigger. All right, William, please remove your mask. Wonderland! Yay. How about we think about all the fun things associated with it instead of all of the... Funnel cake? That. The smell of funnel cake? This Still is by far the worst one. Yes, by far the worst one. I don't even think I'm going to do it. William. I don't think I'm going to do it. You have to. I don't think I'm going to do it. So we have a couple things planned for you. Two things. A couple. Two things. I think the last time I was here I was 11. And did yeah. you go on the rides? No. Yeah, you used to just like stand at the bottom the, and like eat the funnel cake. I would hold the jackets and <laughs> eat the funnel cake. That's, that's yeah. literally my role here is to hold the jackets. Hold you with the jacket holder? Yeah. Well, you're gonna face your fears today. This is what we're doing. And actually, we're doing that. But we're doing something else first. Get, no you, way. get you around, yeah. started, you know? Yeah. Come on, guys, let's go. <laughs> Literally no line for this ride. I feel like my heart is gonna explode oh. right now. I'm just ushering you to the front. I'm not going on. But then again, you see little girls like that just walk by. They just did it with like yeah. no no problem, which makes it a little bit easier. Oh man. You ready? I'm Give actually. I feel like I'm gonna throw up. Ready, just don't okay. throw up on me, please. All clear. Get ready. Count in three, two, one. It's not helping, he's screaming, she's passed out. Is she actually? Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's screaming, she's passed out. Yeah, they did, sometimes they do that. So I'm gonna get showered with like insect vomit. The best way to explain it is you're on like this, like the most obscene model trip. Like I, my eyes are closed, and I was just seeing colors. I like roller coasters, and that was that oh. was too much. That was scary. I wouldn't do it again. I didn't realize you literally go upside down. We were upside down. Out of ten, was that? That was a, that was a, a fifty-five. Yeah. A fifty-five. That was a fifty-five. But I'm very proud of myself for doing that. The worst part is like the initial launch, the coming down because you, you, you're lifting off the seat. Oh! We're proud of you. We're very proud of you. So we just waited in line for like half an hour for a $24 sub. I feel like they overpriced everything at theme parks. Of course, where else are you gonna go? Yeah, but I don't know if this is the best idea because we're going to another roller coaster after this. But we should appreciate Katie for a second because if she didn't go on, I wouldn't have gone on. She's coming on the next one with me. You need me too? Yeah. I got you. you yeah. So is there anything about this next one that we're going on that's crazy? We just got in the biggest drop in Wonderland. In Wonderland? I think, I think yeah. In North America. Or at least at one point it was in North America. I don't know if it still is. Um, the steepest drop too. Yeah. So I've yet to hit, like, reach homeostasis back again. Like I'm still like kind of shaking. But I feel like once you conquer that, it kind of just sets the tone. You can kind of just do all the rest. So we walked over to Leviathan and they won't let us film on the roller coaster. So you can't really see me doing it. So there's not really any point to doing it. I'm you already. Lucked out, like, I lucked out. I'm emotionally already wrecked. Like I'm supposed to go to the gym after this. Like. I, I feel like this body feeling I've never, I can't even explain. So they said that we can go and do something fun in exchange for the next hour or so yeah. until we have the last and final event we've been performed before. Three, two, one. Oh. I won, I won, no I won. Yeah. Okay, knight in shining armor. 
Yeah. There you go. Thank you. So cute. So we are on Scugog Island, just outside of Port Perry. Okay. Unofficially, it's called Ghost Road. Okay. Um, Do you want to know why it's called Ghost Road? Yes, I would like to know. Okay, so it's called Ghost Road because this is a very short road, actually. Okay. Um, and in like the late 60s, a motorcyclist was trying to test the speed of his motorcycle. So he started at one end and was trying to see how fast he could go, not realizing that the road ended right away. Um, so he ended up having to stop really quickly. He flipped off. Mm -hmm. There's two versions of what happened. One of them is that he went into that fence right there and was decapitated. Yeah. One of them was that he fell right onto this rock and bled out. The ghost rock. A lot of the time people say that if you walk the road at night, you can still see his single spotlight from his bike. We are going to be dropping you out at one end and making you walk back to us. And then you have a special reward for you. And we do have a special reward for you at the Once end. you get here. Once you get back. What's the best way to talk to a dead person? Um, politely. Yeah, that's like one of, actually, that's actually one of my biggest fears. Me too. Spirits, ghosts and stuff. So yeah. It's always good to be a good person so they don't come back to bite you. Friends come and go, enemies accumulate. Quick little pee before we get going. Um, feeling pretty scared not gonna lie um emotions are pretty gross i, I kind of want to install them right now um so it's just me i got a light and uh got some bear spray to be very handy although i don't know how to use it i am for sure being stalked by some sort of wildlife right now i know i look tasty but Always gotta look behind you. You don't want to go sneaking in your back door. I am fully expecting a paid actor to come pop out at me momentarily, so. I'm concerned about three things right now. Obviously, one being the old man ghost on his bicycle. Two, random pedestrians slash a gang, because fun fact, this area is actually the Hells Angels stomping grounds, so that would not be a fun interaction. And of course, bears, wildlife of that nature. Spirits are not my thing. Do you guys believe in ghosts? Comment down below. I'm a true believer in ghosts. You're banging. Why is there banging? Why is there banging? That's not good. I'm so scared right now. Oh! I felt a soul penetrate my body. There was no headless man, unfortunately. There was just a lot of birds, but holy shit. That actually doesn't even compare to that damn slingshot earlier. Oh, Are you ready for your reward? I am totally ready for my reward. Surprise. No, no. Usually when I get a reward, it's cake, a little less dough, a little more nut. Mm -hmm. Yay. It's not a donut, it's a cupcake. It's part. The whole, oh. oh. Do you normally eat cake like that? Good reward? Oh man, I feel exhilarated, yo. I feel good. I feel like I've just grown as a man. I feel like I've become better as a person. I think that's what this video is all about. Yeah. I think I could tackle anything right now. Another cake donut? No. Yeah.
Good morning, everybody, or should I say good afternoon. Yesterday completely wiped me out. I literally just woke up and it's almost noon, which is a massive sleep in for me. So a lot of things that I did yesterday, I didn't want to do, but once I did it, I felt great. I felt like, I felt just amazing. So moral of the story is if you have something that scares you, I encourage you just, just to face it head on because you know, nothing bad can come out of it. It's just gonna make you grow as a person. And I think you're gonna be happy that you did it. So I'm gonna wrap up the video here. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to drop it a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one.